and welcome to Mickey Art. My name is Michelle Edhouse and today I'm taking you on a bit of a whirly gig roundabout. Uh, <laughs> what do I mean by that? Well, I've got my spinner out. My spinner is a children's pottery wheel, um, battery operated, two speed kind of thing available on my Amazon shop. So jump online and check that out there's a link in the description below uh, now what I'm using color wise let me show you and I know some of you are going to say Michelle the challenge is no red but this is a red I made from my crimson red and the deep yellow so this is actually a mixed color it is not a primary color um, the brownie colour in the middle is um, made from vermilion orange and cobalt blue. And then, of course, we've got gold, which is not a primary colour. So this will fit for the challenge of uh, no black, no white, and no primary colours, which is the Acrylic Pouring for Fun Facebook group challenge for this month. So I've got my colours mixed up. Uh, as you can see, I have got a bit of a mess that I made while mixing, and I have um, I have my record on my spinner, and uh, I have videos about how I do that. Um, you do need to sort of pack it up a bit because the, the spinny bit sits even or slightly below the outside, so you have to pack it up a bit. Anyway. And it never quite spins perfectly central, so don't expect it to be instantly perfect, because it's not. Um, but what I'm actually going to be doing today is something that I spotted on somebody else's channel. Um, I think it was Julie from Pouring Your Heart Out, and she was doing a spiral pour, uh, but she had two layers of the colours. Uh, and I've only ever done one layer and get that whole dark to light thing going on. So I thought, oh, that's fun. The other thing I saw, and it was in a post on the Acrylic Pouring for Fun Facebook group. And I'm sorry, I cannot quote who posted it. But it was, um, it was almost perfect rings rather than um, a spiral, which I thought was quite cool. Anyway, I'm going to have a go, see what we can create with a double layered cup. So first of all, we need a cup to pour out of. Uh, the one thing I hadn't prepared earlier. How's it getting any better than that? Where are we? Um, it's not really what I wanted. I might need to wash this. Knock, knock. Who's there? Something to dry it with. Knock, knock. Who's there? I think this jug's getting pretty grubby. All right. Let's give it a go. It's damp, but that's okay. I'm, like, I'm good with that. Now, I'm going to start off with our brown. Then I'm going to go in with our dark orange. Let's call it dark orange because it's not allowed to be red. It's, it's, it's red tinted orange. <laughs> it's a mixed color, who cares? And as you can see, I'm just pouring that down the side so that it layers. And then I'm going to do the same again with the gold. 
Now my gold's a bit thicker than the other two colours, so I'm not sure how this is going to work. But, hey, you know, life is an experiment. So, let's experiment. I'm going to have a lot of colour. Now, normally when you guys watch me pour, I pour with my spinner on go go gadget fast this time i'm going to just going to have it on slow so let's see wow i think i've got way too much paint here but i can always stop pouring part way through that's for sure let's give it a go Eek. <laughs> Oh, it's a bit wobbly, isn't it? No silicon in this, and that has now covered the whole thing. But we are getting some cells. Check that out. Can you see that? I hope you can. Let's see. Zoom you in. Getting some cell-like structures, especially where the the red's coming up from the gold. Through the gold. I'm liking it. I really am. That's unusual for me. <laughs> it's popping the air bubbles, which is really important on a spin. There is a lot of air bubbles created on a spin. And as there's no silicon, I'm not really expecting too much change but I am wondering what will change as it matures it's subtle but while Wet. I'm finding those colours are really nice together. As per usual. Uh, maybe it's the angle I look at my phone on. No, it's not. That's a lot more the colour I'm seeing. I seem to have an air bubble in my centre point. This will make a really great clock. And I'm actually seeing like a person or a house shape in there. I like it. Well, that was quick and easy. I have a lot of paint left. So, what I think I might do is put this one to dry, come back your time in a few seconds, and show you the dry result, and start another video, see what I can do with the other colours, the rest of that pot, because I've still got about that much left, which is just under half of what I had to start with. So maybe I'll add another colour. Maybe I'll do something weird with it. Who knows? So if you haven't subscribed yet and you want to see what I do with it, make sure you hit that subscribe button uh, and the little notification bell just to make sure that you get to see what magic I create with the rest of this. But for this painting, I'll see you back here 
in three, two, one. Okay, so as I was tidying up in order to use the rest of that in the next video, guess what I spotted? Ah, that looks so yummy, 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 yummy. So what I'm going to do, you guys know me well, if you've been around a while, is come on down my cabochon. And I'm going to let that one dry. Let me, come on. You can do better than that. There we go. That's funky. I like it. I'm looking forward to seeing that dry. All right, guys. Here comes the actual dry. Ta-da! Oh, my goodness. I just really like this. This is a brown I could get used to. <laughs> Brownie red. Check it out. Oh, just stuck to the bottom. Oh, it's still got tape on the bottom. That's why. Let's get rid of that. Check this out, guys. It is just yummy. It's rich and glorious and the gold is just glinting through as if it's uh, just peeking out of a mining seam. It, I, it's just yummy. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, wow. And we've got just a single ring of sort of like cells through there. Uh, but it's just pretty. It's pretty yummy. Um, I'm. It's even like really well scented. Check it. <laughs> I'm so happy with this. It's uh it's kind of like a chocolate brown and a red. It's just oh yum 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 yum. How did I get so clever? Ah. Uh, I chose it. <laughs> uh, How does it get any better than this? I had somebody comment on one of my videos the other day and they're like, one day I hope to be as clever as you. And I'm like, one day I hope to be as clever as me too. Ah, <laughs> uh, But I'm really, really pleased with that. It's, um, oh, yeah. Let me just brighten it up a little bit for you. I think it needs to be brighter. Um, so that's that's pleasing. And this is super pleasing too. Check out the, the cabochon that I dipped. If it will focus. Again, it's got the gold. It's got the depth. It's... I like it. I like that one too. So... What else is possible, guys? What else can we choose? What else can we play with? Again, super grateful for all of you that joined me on the live stream yesterday. That was so much fun. I had so much fun. And I'm so grateful to you all. Um, so if you guys missed being live on that, you can sign up at this URL. And... Um, You'll get a 24 hours notice of where to be and when, I my YouTube channel at a certain time. And of course, if those of if there's any of you that want to join us on the live, talk to Michelle during the live stream, not just type it Michelle delayed, um, then check the description below for my Patreon. I'm so excited about that. So, how's it getting any better? What else is possible? And uh, I have used some of the leftovers. So there's another video coming in a couple of days with that. Um, and what else is possible? I've really enjoyed sharing this with you and 
super looking forward to what else is possible i adore you guys thank you again so much for following my channel um those of you that are subscribers i adore you you are so so awesome um if you're not hit the subscribe button come have some more fun with me in the next video and what else is possible make sure you hit that notifications bell uh so that hopefully youtube will remember to tell you when i go live and what else what else how much fun can we have where else can we play and as per usual if somebody notifies me before i hang it on my own wall that they'd like to buy these then they are available i adore you guys and i'll see you again super soon bye bye